Cancer, this is your reading from the 9th to the 15th of May 2022 and welcome. It's the 7th of May so I'm just, just in time. So I hope you're well. I'm using the Rock and Roll Tarot and what I would like to say is we have the full moon on the 16th. We're going into Mercury retrograde on the 10th. And with these cards, you can have an extra reading and interact with me because I said I want to interact more with my viewers. Well, with this deck, you can have a look at which word jumps out the most and resonates with you. First of all, we have the Knight of Swords. So there you go. The, if you would like to have a look at all the cards, then have a look at the review. Okay, sweetie. So, uh, Cancer, you've also got the Page of Cups. That can be you, but prominently it is um, Pisces. And we also have the Page of uh, Wands, which is Sagittarius. We also have the Nine of Wands upside down. And we've got the Star. So that's the overall energy. And this shows that you, uh, your wish could be coming true and also that there is no bitter or tough times to go through because if it is in the upright the nine of wands then it means that times are difficult or hard now i've just enlarged the uh, screen so have a look take a screen print and have a look which word jumps up out at you the most okay so that's the um, star card, that is the wish, the dream, the goal card, but also represents Aquarius. So come into action, let the uh, cosmos and the divine and the angels know what your wish is. If you're looking for a job, then come into action and start searching. They will help you. It won't fall out of the sky. If you want your wish or your goal to come true, I think the word goal um, is a better word than a wish because for a goal you have to start running to shoot that ball, ball in the net so again say, um, saying um, get started taking action Th sitting on your laurels won't make it happen also you will get a news this could be official news since the uh, Knight of Swords, the Swords mainly, represents municipalities and officiality or institutions. So you could be getting news. This news will come in very fast as the Knight of Swords is the, one of the fastest. Also, um, this could come through email, text message or telephone call. Okay, so the ones are the fastest, then it is uh, the, uh, the swords but I think the swords are faster and swifter than um, the um, rods they're more or less alike like Gemini their opposite sign is the um, Sagittarius okay so we've also got the page of um, cups so this could be news about uh, love this could be news about something that you do love or you're passionate about this could be a hobby or this could be a person coming in as well, inviting you out to dinner or to go out um, and get to know each other. It could be somebody that is younger than you. The news can also be about something in the baby shoes. If you're planning to do something and it's only an idea because it's a wish, um, then it could be news uh, about that. So making it, making it come into the material world. You could also find yourself more inspirational or uh, emotional, highly sensitive. You might be doubting something because your intuition is saying no, 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 or don't, or do it this way, or do it that way. That could, could also be the subconscious ideas. Talk to somebody about it so that you can make a good start. And you, this is spirit child, that word sticks out. So you could be more spiritual today as well. Definitely messages. This could also be for, for those that are going through uh, a divorce or trying to get a, um, a grant for a child, for example, for a study, then this could be the news about that grant. If you've applied for a loan because you want to build a house, then 
it could be granted. That news is all around you, or all around us actually, because we've got two children, so it could be news about two children. could be that somebody has um, given birth to twins. Okay. So, definitely, this could also be news about a hobby, like I said, passion. You've got big passion here, because you've got two cards that represent passion. The cups also represent love. But the, um, the fire signs, they represent action, uh, being strategic, logic, so plan. So you might get some news so that you can develop your plans to what you want, because that is what the fire signs also stand for. There is not going to be any difficulty or delays by the looks of it, because the nine of ones is upside down. Now I'm turning it around so that you can see the words um, um, properly. And we have resistant and we have wounded, we have in guard and doubt. And those are the words for me that stand out. So you don't have to resist anything, you don't have to doubt anything, because your wish is going to come true. Wow, well those are your cards, but this reading, I forgot to tell you, uh, Cancer, Cancer, that I'm doing uh, two readings in one. So I'm going to use the cards, and then I'm just going to make it slightly smaller, so that you can see the cards coming in. And this is going. To, this is your general reading, so it means that the wish is coming true. Also, I'm going to use an other deck, and this is going to be mainly your financial reading. And why I'm combining it today is because you've got two uh, readings, and you can see whether these cards resonate with your financial reading. And I think it makes it all a lot easier for me as uh, for the viewer. Okay, because um, this reading is for the 9th to the 15th, so we are all uh, halfway through the month. Okay, now the one that's going to represent you in the reading, the querent, that's going to be the knight, the queen, or the king. Okay, not the page. <clears throat> So you come in with the Four of Pentacles, the Two of Cups, see if anything else resonates with the others, the other cards. We've got the Ace of Swords, the Judgment card, the Page of Pentacles, the Queen of Swords, the Queen of Pentac uh, Pentacles, we've got the King, of the Emperor rather, we've got the Three of Hearts, the Death card, the Nine of Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, the page of uh, the six of wands, the six of cups, the star card, and that's coming out again. Wow. Okay. So that's quite strong. So definitely a wish is coming true. We've got the knight of swords, the eight of pentacles, the king of cups. So that is you. And the king of cups does represent um, a cancer prominently. But it can all, he can also, if he does appear in a reading, then I say it can also be um, a Scorpio or Pisces. Now, I'm going to pull out the cards right above it, because I need nine cards. This is you in the center. So let's just pull these cards out. It looks pretty good, actually. Ah, really, really good. So, and a row below you. So, that's going to be the row, three of wands, the moon, the knight, king of swords, the page of cups, the queen of wands. Well, there you are, the queen of wands. That could be that, Sag uh, uh, that page of uh, wands. It's mainly Sagittarius, but, you know, there's, all, there's so many people. And you've got the empress, and you've got the temperance. Now, with regards to finances... Uh, you could be getting, if you're wishing for a promotion or a wage rise or getting a job, if you haven't got a job, 
the answer is you're going to be successful okay we've got the king of cups that's you now this is the row in the past that's what I'm going to take in the recent past you've been really wanting to have a more luxurious life and more money more material gain also something for long term um, and with tangibility and durability more security well you you've been working hard for it with the eight of pentacles you've got the recognition people are seeing you for who you are okay and you have gone for what you want for the for the careers to make and um, you've gone for the investment or the career um, uh, to make more money and you will succeed because this is above you because that is the six of ones and that means success success and recognition so that is above your head that is coming in so the and it's lying next to or close to the star, uh, star card as well now you've got two uh, nines here <clears throat> also um, that's lying what is lying uh, beneath you is the empress that means that time is fertile for new beginnings you could also find out that you're pregnant if that is your wish and you will have the money or enough money to bring up the child uh, because it will take money but you've gone for what you want and whether it costs money or not you will have the money you will have the recognition um, the six of wands means victory success recognition going on to the next level this could be promotions or a pay a wage price this could be if you're getting together with somebody getting married getting engaged and there will be enough money for um, a, a good luxury life okay and the queen uh, the, the mean the empress she always sows a next crop before the her last crop will flourish okay somebody could be coming in giving you money or a gift so um, this is also you could be reminiscing uh, about your childhood life the six of cups um, the six of cups is are also the give and take sharing and sharing alike so um, if you've helped somebody in the past then they could be um, with giving a gift or a helping hand they could come back and give you that as well also the advice here is learn from the past let go of negative energy or negative memories make to make room for new memories and experiences also you are going to beat the competition because you've got the five of ones it means competition um, so if you've got your own business or if you were competing uh, for the same position for a job or a promotion you'll be the one because you've got success um, and you've got um, temperance which is Sagittarius again so there could be a prominent Sagittarius around you cancer that might have helped you to get your success might have done a good word for you or might have given you some knowledge on how to do it it's great now in the diamond you have the victory this is the diamond I call it the diamond you've got the victory but you can start this anywhere but I always start at the north you are going you are going onwards and upwards and you've beaten the competition now it is your new beginning because your hard work is paying off again if you keep maintain balance and go with the flow and do your research and keep your emotions under control you'll be landing in a beautiful voluptuous garden or a good face of life again you've gone for what you want whether you go this way you are remembering um, how wonderful um, it was when you knew what you wanted to be when you were a child all children have dreams and want to be a nurse or a doctor or a fireman a policeman something like that you have kept your emotions under control and you've been um, studying and working hard and now you've got the status of the king and you can go for what you want like the queen of uh, wands so it is absolutely a beautiful reading 
definitely maintain the balance don't be scared about the competition keep some money aside for a rainy day because you have plenty you might be even uh, be able to pay back a loan if because somebody is giving something either somebody's paying back some uh, a loan to you or you are paying back a loan to somebody else because your finances will be as sound as a pound now I've got a little um, card from the uh, Oracle Messenger cards from Heidi Messenger and you've got White Sage now White Sage is used to purify and clear negative energy the protective power <coughs> of the sacred white smoke clears all negative out making way for the new and that is the six of cups now I'm also going to draw a card from the energy oracle and uh, that will be the energy for the coming week or the coming month uh, with regards to your finances you've got number 50 you've got number that becomes a five You've got the five of wands here, so the five is coming back. You're halfway there somewhere, um, or you might be feeling out of sorts. Well, don't feel out of sorts, because your dream is coming true. There's people around you that love you. A lot of mother types. Um, we've got the... Um, uh, this is a sort of motherly type. And, um, somebody that's mature, that has made their money, that's made their quest... Um, we've got the father and mother figure here, but we've got a lot of ladies as well. So there could be a, a lady that you respect that is career orientated um, and she knows how to go for what she wants. This could be that Sagittarius. Um, also um, nurturing, the Empress, the nurturer. Okay, so the Angel of Strength. So definitely the Angel of Strength means that your a patience, your tenacity, your determination um, and your love um, and the way you've been working are going to bring in big returns number 50 personal power and inner strength this amazing angel brings the news that this is the time of increasing power for you it's not the time to be passive or submissive, but to speak your truth and take action. And this is action as well, the Queen of Wands. You're, you're on behalf, your own behalf, you are capable of taking greater control and directing your own destiny for the power that comes from within reaches out to the universe and beyond like I said come into action inner strength and unlimited resourcefulness flow through you as this time helping you to create real results call upon this wonderful angel and and on your own inner resourcefulness to bring you the full focus and re resolve to do what's necessary in order to make your dreams a reality dreams wishes so that is really beautiful how it comes together right wow i hope you've enjoyed this reading uh, cancer take care stay safe and have a beautiful week love you all thank you for liking and subscribing bye bye